President of the United States of America, authorized by Act of Congress, 9 July 1918, has awarded the Silver Star to Sergeant First Class Brasher, United States Army, for gallantry in action on 8 December 2007, while assigned to A Company, 1st Battalion, 508th Parachute Infantry Regiment, in support of Operation Enduring Freedom. While engaged with over 20 determined Taliban fighters on the second day of Operation Mar Karadad, Sergeant First Class Brasher placed his own life at risk on multiple occasions in order to protect his subordinates. His fearless actions and dedication to mission accomplishment enabled 2nd Platoon to destroy the enemy resistance during the liberation of Musakala. Sergeant First Class Brasher's daring acts of intrepidity and gallantry in the face of a numerically superior and determined enemy force are in keeping with the finest traditions of military service and reflect great credit upon himself, Task Force One Fury, Combined Joint Task Force 82 and the United States Army. talk a little bit about how you got here. Um, well, the night before we had, uh, we had this objective we had to take, it was basically like this radio tower on a hill. Uh, having done that, we stopped for a couple of hours until it got light. As soon as it got light, the uh, Taliban started shooting at us. Um, and it, we tried dropping mortars and things like that, but it, it wasn't really very effective. So we went down and down at the base of the hill. There's a the cultivated area, the green zone, and we, uh, we you know, were going to root the guy, bad guys out. So we went down there. We we came under fire from uh, from a, a relatively fortified position. Uh, so we were sort of pinned down in the position we were at. So I took a squad around to go, you know, try to get a good angle on the guys. And in the process of attacking the, that position, I was shot. But you kept going. Uh, yeah, more more or less. I mean, the pain was something else. But uh, you know, I mean, we're, we're there in the middle of nowhere. It's not like you could just suck your thumb and stop. So. Weren't any medics around to haul you away? Well, that's the good thing about being the platoon sergeant is the medics with you. So he was right there, and uh, you know, he did he did his uh, his aid, the morphine and the tourniquet and all that stuff, and he got me. Uh, he stopped the bleeding and all that stuff, so I was able to get up and get away from the uh, the uh, the guy that shot me. So what were you thinking as all this is going on? When I was shot, mm -hmm. I was thinking how much it hurt. I mean, it hurt. It hurt like crazy. I, but uh, you know, part of I was I was also aware that we, you know we were still in a dangerous situation, and uh, at that point, uh, it was probably time to step back and maybe call in some sort of bomb or something on the on the guys because uh, just directly ramming into them wasn't going to work. We were going to take more casualties, and we did. We had another guy wounded. Uh, Sergeant Lee was wounded as well. Are you right-handed? I was. But uh, I haven't been for the last ten months. It's kind of hard to fire a weapon when you're shot in the army. Well, it is, it is. But fortunately, I have my left hand. So if, if and when I heal, well, when I heal, uh, I should be good to go. And one of the other your commanders said you just want to get back to work. Yes, I just want to, you know, really my my goal, my goal when I join the army is not to sit behind the desk or do any of that stuff. It's to, it's to at this point lead, lead guys. And my, the best, best, probably the best year of my life in the military was last year as a platoon sergeant. So I'm looking forward to doing that again. You got, is your group going to redeploy soon? They're going uh, later next year. Yeah, I don't, I don't know if I'll be uh, a part of that or not yet. It all depends on whether I heal or not. But you want to? Oh, definitely, definitely. What does the sword mean to you? Um, well, like I said, you know, it's a, it's an honor to be included with, uh, you know, the types of heroes that I've known. Um, I, it's 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 humbling to think that that those guys think that I'm, you know, that I deserve something like this. Um, 
So I'm glad that I've earned their respect.